Hello, this is H.G. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Parasite Eve! Last time, made my way back down here to save, and well, now let's head on back up to the third floor and try to find Shiva, Ben. Save both of them if we can. Took quite a beating from some of the enemies when I was uh, storing, or, well, yeah, when I was going back off screen there, and yeah, I'm almost about to get another level there. Gotta reload there, and I'm not quite at full HP. Whatever shall we do? I mean, besides use one of the ten medicines that's in my inventory. Yeah, I'm sure you'll be fine, completely trapped in this room. Oh, yeah, if you talk to her, she can heal you up completely there. Because she can only do it one time, and only during day three. So, might as well put it to use. Why not? Okay, well that's everything we can do here. Got lucky, didn't run into any repeat battles on the way. So, I'll check out your locker later. Besides, he's dead. He doesn't care. Now, you want to be careful here. Yeah, they changed the perspective. If you keep holding right, which you would have held in order to get to this screen, and then you went onto this screen, it would... Uh, what is it? Ow. You would end up walking back to the previous screen there. So, yeah, they changed the directions on you. It's kind of annoying. Oh, well. But anyway, we get another level. Awesome. I never really use Confused myself. I don't think it's useful. But, well, if you like it, more power to you. So, let's see. Up there, there's the morgue, but there's no treasure in there. So, I'm not particularly interested. I don't think anything ever happens in there, except I think there's like a, a random battle or something, but I'm I'm fine. I'm not worried about that right now. Probably slightly overleveled anyway. Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, we got a bonus point. I knew there was something I was forgetting. Okay, put another one there, and I think we're all set and ready to go. I hope Ben went this way. It's the only room left. Oh, yeah, I guess they did now. Or, I am here now. They know I'm here. Hooray! Not anymore. Well, kind of late for that one there. But, well, I'll do the best I can. In the words of Zombie Torres... Guns don't kill people. I do! <laughs> for bus time! Against Cerberus, or Shiva, or whatever you want to call it. Whoa, okay, uh, real quick here. Use Barrier. Because that'll hit you no matter where you are, pretty much. Okay, now for this part, for this fight, there's three parts to the head there. But it looks like I gotta try and get away as much as I can. Okay. So anyway, yeah, you want to shoot the middle head there. Just like against the Mega Sisters and Final Fantasy IV, you want to take out the middle one first. And it looks like my barrier wore off, so that's for that. Whoa! Watch out for laser. Yeah, the reason you want to hit the little or the middle one is because it will heal the other two. Keep on moving. There we go. Man, these bosses are pretty slow. All right, I think I got one of. Them. I think I got the middle head there. Okay, good, good. Uh, let's actually use one of my medicine tubes. Good. Just to keep myself up on HP there. Whoa! Yeah, you don't want to get caught on the side. Nuts. Well, so much for that plan. That didn't work out too well. Well, okay, I guess I'll use a Medicine 3, because otherwise I'm just going to dump it anyway after this day. So, let's see. Okay, can I get a barrier through? Yes, good. Yeah, I like using barrier against enemies with attacks that I otherwise can't dodge almost no matter what. I think if you're, like, in the opposite corner, you might be able to, uh, avoid it. Or not take more damage. But otherwise, yeah, there's not a whole lot you can do about it. Ha ha. Yeah, just keep on moving around like that, and he won't be able to hit you. But we do have a pretty good range there. It looks like I got the head, but he still got in one more attack anyway. How does it even work? Well, anyway. Watch out for the lasers. 
yeah, once you uh, once he goes into PC boss mode, he starts moving around with that laser there, so you want to watch out for that. But we got him. Or her. Hooray! I don't know what gender Shiva was. I don't think they ever specified. But whatever. It's not important. Shiva's dead. Damn you, Eve. Nuts. Why did you call him Uncle Baker? Well, maybe he was always hanging around. I don't know. I mean, he's, he obviously doesn't mean that literally. Well, I guess Baker could be Lorraine's brother. I don't think they ever say anything like that, but I suppose maybe hypothetically. There's nothing to disprove that. Aww. Oh. Well, that's it. Uh, no, I think we'll just keep on going. Why not? Hmm? Oh, yeah, Baker's kind of gone. I think he's gone for the rest of the game. We never see him again. It's just like, yeah, I got hurt. Oh, darn. Okay, bye. See ya. I'm not going to get burned alive. Oh, yeah. Well, she could have just burned everyone alive. Hmm. I wonder. The office looks fine to me. What, what hospital? Everyone's evacuated. Oh, I wonder why. Hmm. Well, okay, let's head on up there then. But before we do that, remember there was a, a key card or a key or whatever that thing was that we got before from the, the one of the cops who died there. Well, he had a lock to locker there, but now we can open it. So let's see what is our prize. Oh, okay, I get it. They were saying they wanted to clean up the office. I think they meant the whole place, not just, like, Baker's office. But anyway, with the locker key, we get a trading card. Hmm. wonder what we do with those. That's the second one that I've gotten. Hmm. Well, let's ask Wayne about them. I gotta store some stuff downstairs anyway. And, uh, I hope you remember your way up to the third floor there, viewers, because I'm gonna meet you there off-screen eventually. But I do want to talk to Wayne a little bit first before going upstairs to the crime lab there. Hey, how's it going? Well, yeah, Torres is gone. Oh, well. You seem a little overly enthusiastic about Torres dying and being able to take over this place. But anyway, Wayne likes trading cards. So instead of mod permits... You give them trading cards in order to get more slots on your weapons. Mod permits still work. And there's really no difference between the two. Other than... Other than, uh, I guess Torres won't take trading cards. But other than that... So... Yeah, it seems kind of pointless. But, well, now we have trading cards that we can do stuff with there. So, oh well. Not that I'm really going to use them. It's really not until day five when you really get into a lot more of the customization of the weapons and stuff like that. Okay, so we got all this stuff here. Let's just ditch all that. Get rid of all the medicines that I'm never going to use. Same thing with the trading card. And let's see. Any equipment here? Okay, well, we got more ammo here, so let's put that, get rid of that, and, okay, this is bothering my OCD. Let's, uh, get rid of all that ammo from the reserves there. There we go. So, let's see. If you're using the rifle, obviously, you'd want to hold on to the SG-550, but I'm not. 
Let's see. We got a handgun from uh, Shiva or Cerberus there that I'm never going to use. So I'm not especially worried about that. Reload the machine gun. Arrange everything nice and cleanly. Okay. I think that's everything here. Oh, do we... Oh, no, we don't get anything from these boxes yet. Okay. I'll meet you on the third floor then. Okay, we're back. And uh, one other thing I almost forgot about. We got a, a bonus point after defeating Shiva there. So we'll just put that into the weapon there. Nice. Can never have enough bonus. Okay, how's it going? Can I get another heal up? Well, actually, it was Daniel who thought you'd be here, but yeah. What do you mean by that? What is this place anyway? I mean, they said it's like a crime ID, crime lab or ID thing or something. I don't know. They got a bunch of plants in here, but I don't know. Huh. That's weird. You'd think she'd want to be here to finish us off. Why bother distracting us if she can just kill us? Well, I guess she can't kill Aya. Or at least not that easily, anyway. Or maybe she just doesn't want to. I don't know. Hmm. New York City? Sperm Bank? Nah, that couldn't possibly exist. So... Can't the mitochondria help him out? Or help the body out? Oh, okay. Oh, well, there we go. But even if she did get inseminated, wouldn't it still take several months for her to give birth? I mean, that's... Kind of a long time to have to wait for that sort of thing. Then again, I guess she is kind of a different species now. Kind of reminds me of another movie. But anyway, we get some more ammo from Daniel there. Not that we really need it. How many do I got in my reserves now? Like 500? <laughs> Something ridiculous like that. I wish Aya would get a little more bloodthirsty as the game went on. Kind of like EG. But then again, I suppose she's already a cop and she's calm, cool, and collected and everything, so. Oh, okay. Well, that explains it. Well, yeah, gotta take care of the boy. Hmm? Well, it didn't make it, did it? Otherwise, we'd all be assimilated or inseminated or whatever. I don't know. Oh. Well, wouldn't the same problem happen here? I mean, all we gotta do is just sit on our ass and the mitochondria will beat itself. Shoot itself in the foot, huh? Why is Meta coming with us anyway? I mean, anytime we get close enough to Eve, you burst into flames, I mean, what are you gonna do? I heard that St. Francis Hospital actually doesn't exist on Manhattan Island in real life. It's a, well, at least relative to the game, a made-up location. So, well, let's, oh, I was going to say, let's head on in there, but, or not. Hmm? Oh, yeah, this was in, uh, the entrance here was in one of those flashbacks. Well, gee, you think? What were you going to do? Well, anyway... Maida decides to take up an inventory slot again. Thanks a lot. Not. Well, let's take a look inside, shall we? We need to uh, sign in at the desk there first. Might be a good idea. 
Or we could save here first. Why not? So, let's go do that. Let's see. Now, in the upper right corner there, there is a closet there with some treasure. I'll get that later. I already started saving by the time I remembered that, so whoops. Oh, well. But anyway, you try to go in there. It's locked. Let's see. Do they say what we need to get in there? No. Okay. Let's see. Down here. Oh, yeah. There's a chest there with some stuff. I'll get that later, too. I'm just going to go this way and advance the plot a little bit before I start collecting treasure. Hmm? Well, anyway, yeah, we can't get in there because we need a green key card. Let's see, let's go with this door. Ah, there we go. If you press the other button, it goes to this door anyway for some reason. But anyway, let's just, well, head on up to wherever Eve is. I guess she's around here somewhere. Hmm? Uh-oh. Nuts. Can we survive? Find out next time on Let's Play Parasite Eve. This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.